Hello, and welcome back to Popcorn with Popkin. Today's movie that I'm going to review is called King Richard. Uh, this movie is about uh, the famous, famous, famous tennis players, Venus and Serena Williams, two of the greatest tennis players of all time, and Serena Williams probably being like the most dominant athlete to ever walk the earth. So this movie is about them, but it actually um, centers around their father, uh, Richard Williams, and what kind of father he was while they were kids. So both Venus and Serena Williams in this movie are uh, between 10 and 14 years old. And the movie centers around their upbringing and how King Richard, their father, um, was very, very hard on them. And um, almost to the point where um, you don't know if, if it's worth the sort of uh, abuse that he gives to them for them to be as famous as they were. And this is a really powerful movie, and knowing who Serena and Venus Williams are, um, it makes it very special. So I, I was very, very impressed with this movie, especially Will Smith's performance. Um, I think the one thing that makes this movie stand out is uh, their father, he's kind of in a gray area where he does some things that you clearly see he probably shouldn't be treating kids this way because they're just kids, they're just trying to grow up. But then there's other things that he does that clearly lead them to end up being who they are and being like two of the greatest tennis players um, of all time. So it's kind of a moral like gray line question like, yeah, you want these players to succeed and you want these kids to succeed, but they're also just kids. And a lot of the time it comes off as sort of selfish of him not letting his kids decide what they want to do, but, but sort of taking their lives into his own hands. So it's a very complicated relationship between King Richard and the tennis world and Serena and Venus. And um, I didn't know this story at all, so it's, it's a good piece of history to learn. And especially knowing what Serena and Venus become, um, it's, it's really cool. And the thing is, this movie sort of stops when Venus Williams is in her first like major tennis tournament. So there's so much story left to tell. So I'm sure in another 10, 15, 20 years, there'll probably be another movie about Serena and Venus, and they definitely deserve that. Um, something that is really interesting about the father is that he had this entire plan of their lives written out before they were even born uh, to be professional tennis players. and. Um, they're from Compton, California, so their interactions with this um, sort of high-class tennis world is interesting to see because everybody looks at them as outsiders, um, but they just go in there and they beat everybody, which is really satisfying. And for a sports movie, the actual tennis scenes are really good. It doesn't just sort of cut around the tennis playing. You get some good tennis shots and you get some really intense uh, moments in the movie. Um, so I definitely think it's worth watching. Um, it's, it's actually streaming on HBO Max now, as well as in the theater. So if you subscribe to HBO Max, you can watch it right now. And um, the one thing I'll say about the performances is that uh, the two girls who play Serena and Venus, uh, they both do a really good job in their um, respective roles. And the two parents, the mother and the father, they're also really great. Um, it sort of seems like Will Smith this year is like really going for the Oscar. And my prediction is that he wins his first Oscar this year. He's been uh, nominated a few times, um, but I think he's going to win it this year. And I think the mother probably deserves at least a nomination, if not a win for this movie as well. So definitely worth watching. Very interesting story, especially if uh, you're fans of Venus and Serena Williams. So I'm going to give this movie a 4.2 out of 5. Thank you.